Hey everyone, it's Michelle. I know I said in my last haul video that I wasn't going to go grocery shopping for two weeks. However, we had two unexpected um, guests this week in our house, and one stayed for one night, and then one stayed for two nights. And um, so I kind of am running out of some, you know, certain things. So I went and done a quick haul today. I went to Aldi's, the bread store, and Kroger. And I just have them all laid out here. Um, I'm going to start with Aldi's. I got a block of cheese and some sliced cheese. Um, this fuchsia, or fuchsia, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, mandarin orange chicken. Um, I got the stir fried chicken last time, and it was really good. So um, we're going to try this this time. I got... Um, Beef, uh, beef tips. I'm going to do a recipe with that. We need more bacon. I got two bags of oranges and two bags of bananas. Two cantaloupe. I got the cantaloupe for 99 cents a piece. The bananas were 44 cents a pound and these were $1.49 a pack. I got the three pack of, <coughs> excuse me, um, what are these? tri-colored peppers. Normally I wouldn't buy <clears throat> these at Aldi's. I'd get them organic, um, but this week I just didn't feel like getting them organic. I don't know. Um, I got milk chocolate uh, chips, and I got brown sugar. I got um, Aldi's Simple Nature brand of Chipotle black bean soup with black beans and savory vegetables, and... I got this last time, the spicy Thai soup with organic noodles and savory vegetables. And this was really good, so I got another one. And they're only 170 calories for the whole package. No fat. And it's, um, let's see, you got two fiber and six proteins. It has a lot of carbs, but um, that's because of the noodles. However, with Weight Watchers and stuff, they're a good lunch because they're filling. So... Um, and then I got these packs of 12 turkey burgers, the Jenny O. I found these, uh, the gluten-free chicken nuggets, and then with the no antibiotics. And so I picked up two bags of these. These are good for the kids, um, for after school snack, or even to warm up in the oven and put on a salad and have a chicken salad. Um, I got some more of this. Uh, pomegranate plum juice. This is so good. So very good. It's excellent by itself, but it's also wonderful if you put it in a, um, a uh, smoothie. And then I got these raspberry lemonade twists. I haven't tried them, but I wanted to try them. Um, and I know my daughter would like them because she, she likes anything like this. I'm going to put them in her lunch. I don't know if my son would like it or not. But uh, we needed a pack of crackers. They didn't have any wheat crackers, so I just went ahead and got these. And then two packs of the kettle chips mesquite barbecue for my husband's lunch. And I think that's all the Kroger at. Kroger? No, no, no. Aldi's. At Aldi's, I spent $67. At Kroger, I got um, two, I got three half gallon Simple Truth organic whole milks and a half gallon of the vanilla almond milk from Simple Truth. We tried the silk on vanilla almond milk last week and we really liked it. My husband and I and my daughter really liked it. My son didn't care for it too much, but um, that's okay. He can, he drinks whole milk. He's good with that. So, um, I tried, this is the first time I had seen the vanilla almond milk, and they probably carry it, and I just never paid attention, but I seen it today, so I went ahead and picked it up, and, um, we're going to try it and see how that is compared to the Silk brand. All of that was $11 and some change, um, and then I went to my bread store, and I got four loaves of the Sara Lee, um, 100% whole wheat, and it has no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives, and no high fructose corn syrup, and I love that about that bread. And these were 79 cents a piece at the bread store. And then I picked me up a pack of this 100% um, healthy wheat, um, hearty and delicious, 100% whole grain, um, and this also has no fructose corn, high fructose corn syrup. So, um, and then at the bread store, I spent $4 and some change. So, together, I spent 
uh, 67 at Kroger. No, 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 no. 67 at Aldi's plus 11 $12 at Tar or Target. Oh, my goodness, I can't talk. At Kroger. So that's, what, 79 And then $5 at the bread store. So that's, what, 84 I'm not a math whiz, but I'm hoping that's right. So that's not too bad for everything that I got today. This will last us, the bread will last us about two weeks. And then the chips will last him probably a week and a half because they're smaller bags. Um, and then the fruit will last, those will probably last us two weeks, maybe. That will last me because I'm the only one in the family that eats it, probably about two weeks. Um, these are good for lunches on the weekend and quick suppers. Um, so yeah, everything, the milk will probably last us two weeks because we still have a half gallon in the fr uh, fridge. The bananas will last um, probably a week and a half. So I'm not. I'm planning on going next Friday, um, but I'm hoping to go to Costco. So, but anyways, enough about that. I hope everyone's having a wonderful week, and I look forward to reading your comments and subscribe. And um, I'll I'll check out your videos and you check out mine. I hope y'all have a wonderful weekend.